Hey you guys, so we're here to pre-plan another week in my PP weeks. I know super far ahead. And I just I'm just waiting for my penny weeks to show up because I purchased my penny weeks to specifically be my PR slash school slash whatever um planner. And that was delayed a little bit. It's still within her shipping time frames, but the actual planner was delayed a little bit because of um her discs so we're gonna do something we're gonna do something different this time around so I've got my hollow overlays right I as you guys know I set these down as boxes but this time I'm gonna cut them and I'm just gonna use them as overlays because in Melissa's kits BEPD by the way I PR for BEPD shop my code is Stephanie 20 save 20% and receive my Neato PR freebie which I will show you Here's my freebie. I use a sticker that was right there, but cute. But <clears throat> they, you can get these really cute sticky notes. And I actually like writing on the sticky notes. And I have a white pen that I will use to write on this. And black works really, really well on it as well. Plus, these are also like this one is like really fun to be decorative since you don't really can't really write over that one. So that one's really good decorative. So I'm going to do a lot more writing on the actual pages. So I wanted to have but I still wanted to have sparkle and I thought the hollow would go great. So got my handy dandy little scissors so that I can cut the boxes. Let me test it out real quick, guys, real quick like. Where's the edge? And I know that some people have issues ripping the rose colored date boxes. So usually I'll pull it, I'll make sure I can see the line, and then I'll put my finger right there and I'll rip it, and I usually don't have issues. But if I start tugging and I can feel a little resistance, what I'll do is I'll actually bend it at the seam, press down on the seam, and then rip it. That way I'm not destroying the box. So, what I wanna do, you know what, maybe I will actually get my X-Acto knife. And if you've never shopped, oh, come on. Please, please, please. Uh, Melissa uses unicorn paper. And I know in my last couple videos, see that, okay. Unicorn paper generally does not like giving boxes like this back. So that was so nice of the unicorn paper. But if, when you feel unicorn paper and you feel like premium matte or matte or glossy, there is a definite difference. Oh, see, yeah, that is a gorgeous. There is a definite, definite difference. Now, this is not going to exactly fill the whole box. Oh, I put that. See, I didn't even pay attention to that line. Okay, let me go ahead and slice through this. I got so distracted. Now don't cut on your planners unless like you're super confident. But I know that the unicorn paper is slightly thicker. Whoops, I just ripped that box because I was not careful. <clears throat> but the unicorn paper is so soft, so buttery, so smooth. And yes, some shops do charge a higher price point for the unicorn paper. And if that is an issue, there are always sales. Like the TPC sale goes on once a month. So you are bound to find a deal on your favorite, some of your favorite shops. And if you have a favorite shop that does not participate in the Planners Collaborative, have them, <clears throat> have them sign up. You know, get that exposure. The Planner Collaborative sale, I find, is one of the most organized sticker sales 
that I've ever seen. And I'm a part of a bunch of different groups. And Caitlin over at CLLK09, make sure that it's super organized. There are always freebies, always swap shop sampler packs, always an organized list, links, videos, It's a super organized shop. That's actually a sale. That's actually where I found BEPD and I fell in love. Now, I'll be honest, when I first started shopping at BEPD, I was like, I'm like, I am not, I, you know, I don't I don't listen to true crime. I don't do all the things. I'm I'm putting the overlays on the rest of the boxes even though you guys can't see that. Sorry about that, guys, but it's just easier so my fat head doesn't get in the way. But I'm still here, I promise. Ooh, maybe we'll even use some of this as a bottom overlay. We are getting real, I guess, I guess I should, sh I should show you what I'm doing. I'm gonna get real crafty here in a second. I'm gonna try to do something different. But um, like I was saying, when I first found BEPD, I was like, mm, I don't know. I'm not into the whole true crime thing. That's not my jam. Actually, let's use this. Um, if you ever put down an overlay, and like I was saying in a couple other videos, make sure before you scrape it down to try to smooth out the plastic that you're not gonna scrape the foil because some people's foil, if you tried to do that to smooth it out, you will actually ruin your sticker. Okay, so that's about two boxes long, maybe. Maybe a little bit. We'll start with two boxes. We're, we're about to get we're about to get crazy crafty in here. I might have to add a third box, but we'll see. Oh, it's just short. So what I'll actually do is I'll just center it. If I could get this straight. So this is what we're gonna do. And there are some companies. These are rose colored days boxes. If I didn't already say that. There are a couple shops out there that don't perforate your boxes. So it does take a little bit more work to use their boxes anyways. And I totally didn't center it at all like I said I was going to. I'm awesome. See that? I didn't. I'm cool. <clears throat> okay, back to the actual planning, pre-planning, the sticker laying down. If you made it through all of that, thank you. If you fast forward through it, I feel that. Maybe that's not like your cup of tea. That's perfectly fine with me. I appreciate you being here anyways. But I had someone was like, no, 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 she doesn't just do true crime, like check it out. So I started looking more and more and more into her shop and I found scripts that I love. I found kits that I love. And she definitely does more than just true crime because like even she knows like not everyone's gonna be about true crime, right? Um, and Melissa, the owner of BEPD shop is such a hard working person. Like she's a hard working woman. Her, her sticker shop is not her full-time job. She, well, I mean, technically it is a full-time job, but she has a regular full-time job, you know? She raises a family and she runs this sticker shop. So I am so honored and so blessed to be a part of her very first PR team because this will be, this this video will upload the Wednesday after the TPC sale ends. And let me tell you, we made her work. All right. I mean, not just us, but she, 
her shop, her shop like skyrocketed this, this sale. And she attributes it, attribute, attributes it all to us. But we know the truth. It is because her shop's amazing. I was advertising her stickers and her shop on my Instagram, on Facebook. I mean, in my hauls. You guys have seen my hauls. Well before I was a PR girl for her. And when she came out with those Sailor Moon kits, I was like, yes, ma'am. Uh, we're, we're, we're best friends now. Like, you can't get rid of me now. Like, that's it, sis. Okay. Let's start with this right off the bat. Now, if you notice, I'm not doing glitter headers this time around. So that I have a little bit more space to work. Also, she doesn't do weekend banners in her PP Weeks kits. And part of that is because space, oh, I pulled my foil notebook instead of my script. Also, okay, I totally changed the covers on my script sticker album and my, see this is the original album sticker, and my character sticker. Let me show you. See, character stickers. So I happen to have, see, look at those, look at those scripts right there. I can't wait to start using date nights and stuff again. Where's what I'm looking for? See, yes. Okay. Look at that. That's from BEPD shop too. Bum, 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 bum. Here we go. Weekend banner. We'll see, we'll see if I, cause I put the sparkle down there already. We'll see if I wanna do that. So again, we're just super pre-planning. This is again for 2021. This is actually pre-planned into May of 2021. And that makes me so excited cause this is gonna be my carry with me everyday kind of planner. And then I will use this to memory keep in my cloud. I have not received my cloud yet. I just did the pre-order as a Mother's Day slash a birthday um, gift for myself. So you're probably wondering, Stephanie, why are you putting that so far down? Because, oops, these script, these step scripts are from Sarah Elizabeth Prince. She happens to be in the TPC, TPC sale quite a bit as well. And she has amazing scripts. So I like to track my steps in my planner. And I also like to track how many days that I'm practicing my belly dancing. And this is from Craft Penguin Planner. Now, I'm not going to place the vlog script down like I pre-set down in my happy planner for this year. <sighs> because I'm still torn. And I know I lay down vlog stickers in my happy planner for the rest of the year. But I'm, I'm still torn. I also did not put up... By the time you see this, it'll have been two Fridays where I don't have a budget video because my plan was to have my 
Penny Weeks because I ordered a Penny Weeks and a Penny Budget, Penny Weeks Budget Planner. And my plan was to use that for my May budget, even though I already, I probably should check, I don't think I filmed it, but even though I already put um, the stickers down for it, I already made it in my actual budget planner. Because <clears throat> I want to transition into the penny budget planner. So I was, oh, that's a little crooked. So I was waiting for that before I did budget videos, but there was a little delay in Destiny from the Penny Pages getting the discs that she ordered for the budget planners. So, I mean, granted, it's still within her shipping time frame, so it's not it's not about that to me. Um, she's still within her shipping time frames. See, you put this little guy down, right? Hold on, let me, let me lift him up just a skosh. And then depending on what I write there, put a little character sticker there, and then I have some room for like a little design. Or like here we'll, we'll put him pretty high up. Character sticker. Okay, let's do this piece right here. And normally this would look great with the sparkles underneath it, but I'm trying to not like be overboard because like I have weeks without sparkle and then I have weeks with lots of sparkle and I'm still debating putting sparkle down on this week. I don't know, just I love foil. And in the TPC, one of the giveaways was asking if you change something about the way you plan, you know, what would it, what would be weird if you didn't do it? And I said, I'm not known for anything planner wise. And my planner bestie, Diana, was like, um, foil? And I'm like, you know what? You know what, sister? I feel that. I felt that. That's still crooked. Gotta be very careful when you lift up unicorn paper. Okay, we'll get a little coffee here. And see, I'm pre-planning. I'm pre, 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 pre prepping. So character, 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 character. And see, and I can either go in and just handwrite something instead of putting a box down, or later when I actually get to this week, I can put down just a, I can actually put a glitter header down. Um, as a little decorative, just to cover up that space. Because I'm marking down the super important things. And I know, okay, you might be thinking, okay, but the amount of stuff you're putting in this is not going to translate into a cloud well. Well, yeah. So I don't use these dinner stickers, but what I can do is I actually can take a character and just cover it maybe. I'm not sure. These are very pronounced dinner stickers. Haven't decided if I want to try to incorporate them or use them somehow. We'll see. We will see. Some little check boxes right there. Oh yeah, that looks good. And granted, this may not seem like a lot of things to write down, but you know, you want, yeah, I have these grid pages, these note pages if I absolutely need to. If there's just so much that's going on, I can always get sticky notes and, and place it in there if it's not enough, you guys, but 
I'm kind of boring. I mean, if I'm going to be for real, for real, I'm kind of boring. And a lot of times when I fill stuff in, I wonder if this will, do I need to chop it down? Yes. So a lot of times when I'm filling in my happy planner, it's just being filled in with stuff that happened through the day anyway. See, look, now I can go, I can just do that. No sticker left behind, okay? And I want this to be a super functional planner anyways, so I'm really digging this right now. I'm really digging it. And who knows, maybe next year I won't even have Plan With Me's on my channel. I mean, I probably should since, you know, I'm putting the stickers down. But I've also put down vlog stickers and, and some of this too. But we'll see. We'll see how I'm feeling. And just because I've laid the sticker down already, if I'm just not feeling it. I'm just not feeling it. You know what I mean? See, look. I could totally put like a glitter header right there and that would look bomb. So Sunday will go boom. what it is I'm going to be doing on this Sunday, obviously, because it's May of 2021, but we're going to, we're going to find, wow, we're going to find things to put down, things I want to document, things I want to memory keep. That's not crooked, but that's not where it should be. So, choo, choo, choo. so icon would be over here, or I could just put some decorative, or I could use this last box. Yep. And a full PP Weeks kit from BEPD is $12. So if you don't want the sticky notes, you don't have to get the sticky notes. If you don't want this page, you don't have to get this page. You can literally just get the functionals. The very first kit I bought from her, I just bought the functional page. And then I realized, no, I want the coordinating stuff. Now, I haven't used all of these, but I can definitely use them in other spreads. So, this is what I have left over, and I'm really so excited to be so far pre-planned in my planner for 2021. I can't wait. I'm going to, you know, again, I get torn on whether I'm going to film or not, and my filming will be done in the cloud, but I'm going to be using my PP Weeks as part of it. And then I have... Pretty soon, hopefully soon, cross your fingers soon, you're gonna start seeing my PR work done in a completely separate planner. Um, I mean, I bought these kits specifically for my PP Weeks, but you'll see my actual documenting of my PR work in a different planner. Right now it's being done in my happy planner, but you know, I'm so excited. So this is my, this is my spread. Here's all the sparkle, little, little vid wiggle. Here we go. Again, the overlays are rose colored days. The date dots are DEK designs. These scripts are Craft Penguin Planner and Sarah Elizabeth Prince. And everything else came from the kit from BEPD Shop. Don't forget to mention Stephanie 20 in the notes. And happy shopping. Bye.